Jumbo, everyone, and welcome to Fun to Be Free. Today's journey brings us to Disney's Animal Kingdom Lodge. To be on the move, over to the Maharaja Jungle Trek at Disney's Animal Kingdom theme park. Coming up next. Hey Explorers, John with Fun To Be Free, inviting you to follow me as we discover fun together. Let's go. We're here at Disney's Animal Kingdom Lodge. This is where we're gonna start our excursion and we're gonna end up at the Maharaja Jungle Trek at Disney's Animal Kingdom theme park. Follow me. The Maharaja Jungle Trek is where you can embark on a self-guided walking tour in Southeast Asia. We may be able to see monkeys, tigers, bats, and Komodo dragons. In addition to the various amenities offered at this resort, it also has a few savannas with animals. Let's go check that out. Located near the savanna, you could find greater flamingos. Let's head around the corner to the right hand side and see if we could find some more animals out in the savanna. We've come up to the Uzima Savanna Overlook. And if you just look way off in the distance, there's some Ankole cattle out there with the big horns. Now let's reverse our direction and head over to a quick service dining experience. Down this direction here. Over in this direction is the Uzima Springs pool with the water slide off in the distance. Now we need just to go around the corner to the left-hand side. To the Mara. Let's see what's on the menu. The Mara offers entrees like a signature blend bacon cheeseburger, a signature blend cheeseburger, chicken strips, and even flatbreads, like a chicken flatbread, a cheese flatbread, and also sandwiches, like the tamarind barbecue pork sandwich, a ham and cheddar sandwich, a tuna salad wrap, and they have salads as well, like a grilled chicken Caesar salad, a Caesar salad, and even plant-based items, like the Marrakesh falafel platter, and the chickpea salad sandwich. Now let's go inside and see where you pick up your food if you chose the mobile order. There's the mobile order pickup area. Here's the cashier area. And here's the interior dining area. Now let's go back outside. There's also an exterior dining section where you could also enjoy your meal. Now let's continue walking down this pathway back to the lobby. Here's where the Ozima Spring starts, and it heads down to the pool area.
we're going to head through these double sets of double doors back into the lobby. There's a couple of ways to get back to the lobby level. The first option we have is the elevators. And the second option we have are taking the stairs past the Victoria Lounge Falls. There's the steps that we just walked up, but we need to continue walking more up to the lobby level. Over to the right hand side is a suspension bridge that hangs precariously over the lobby. On the other side is the long reception area for check-in. Up ahead is the main entrance of this resort. And over to the left hand side is the Zawadi Marketplace. It's open from 8 a.m. to 10 p.m. daily. Let's go inside and take a look. And we're immediately greeted by some African hand carved art. You could purchase an artist concept of this resort hotel. And just over here to the left hand side, here's what the register app looks like. This gift shop offers some exclusive merchandise to this resort. Like these apparel items here. You could also purchase some native plants, some wooden walking sticks, or even have your name as art on the wall. Now let's take one last look before we go out the exit. We're gonna head out these doors, make a left, and head down the pathway to the Walt Disney World Transportation. The Walt Disney World Shuttle Bus Station, just over here to the left-hand side. Now we just have to go find our bus stop. Oh, and there it is now, Zone 1. It goes to Disney's Animal Kingdom and Blizzard Beach. If you're looking for transportation to just Kidani Village, then board the Disney Springs bus. That's way down here on the end, Zone 5. It looks like our ship has come in.
welcome to Disney's Animal Kingdom. We've arrived at the entrance. Now we just have to go through the touch points. We're now inside the park. We're gonna head over to our right hand side, go into the Oasis, Discovery Island, and then eventually make our way into Asia. We've made it to the Maharaja Jungle Trek. It's time to take a walking tour of the old royal forest, right this way. It's a little hard to see, but the Komodo dragon is basking in the sun on the rock there. That's one big reptile. Next up, monkeys. Look at those guys there, just hanging out. This way to close up, view of bats. This bat's a little hard to see, but he's there. Located next to the bats are some steps that go up. Let's go check that out. Oh, and look at the tiger between the trees. We just descended down these steps, but over to the right hand side are some windows. Let's go see the tiger again.
The theming along this trail is just incredible. And there's a bonus, water buffaloes. Let's go through the chain curtain and down to the exit pathway. There's the exit pathway that we just came from. And just around the corner to the right hand side is the attraction entrance. Now it's time for a Disney's Animal Kingdom theme park flashback. Here we are, near the Maharaja Jungle Trek exit, but sadly, our journey's come to an end. With that being said, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, follow me on Instagram and Patreon. Until next time, see you later, explorers.